The next security property of hash functions is second pre-image resistance. So it shouldn't be possible to find a second pre-image, meaning that given a hash value and the input to the hash function, so in this case y and x1, it should be computationally infeasible, so not doable in the real world, to find a second input with the same hash value. So it shouldn't be possible to find an x2 that hashes to the same y. And here it's quite obvious why that should be the case. So for example, as we have said in signatures, we actually sign hashes of a message, not the message itself. So if somebody says, okay, no, I did not eat the last cookie and then signs this message and sends this message out into the public saying, okay, I did not eat the cookie. Here's the signature. I truly wrote this. You can check it with my public key. Well, if I find a second pre-image, namely another message that I can put into the hash function that returns the same hash value, then for this message, the second message here, the second pre-image, the signature is also valid. So an attacker could just forge a signature by using a valid signature and finding a second input to the hash function that has the same hash output as the original message. And then have signatures of valid signatures of messages the public uh, the private key holder has never signed. So if we find a second message with the same hash, the signature is also valid for this message, of course, which is quite problematic.